Hey there, and welcome back to the channel, and welcome back to our Civ 6 Random Leaders playthrough as Poland, uh, where we left off last time. What? What happened? We took Geelong a while ago. I think, yeah, we've just been uh, maximizing our tourism game. Yeah. Like, I think we're... Are, do we have, like, a countdown? No, it keeps coming and going. <laughs> Like, I'll pop up and be like, oh, 70 turns, and then I'll go away, and then I'll pop up and be like, oh, 200 turns. <laughs> but we are getting there. As you can see, that second number now is, like, about 100 below everyone else. So, we're definitely winning the culture game. It's just we need that uh, first number to get bigger. I guess you can kind of see who we need more people from. So, like... Menelik is really low. Uh, Matthias is especially low. So I think, like, one of our strategies could be to somehow try to get better relations with Matthias. I don't really know what we could do to boost that. We have different governments. I think, yeah, if we can get a trade route and, like, open borders, that would help out. Uh, I think I keep trying to get open borders with everyone. <laughs> but they keep, like, shutting me down. With him... I don't even have the option to, so I don't, I don't know why that is. Adelaide is like losing food for some reason. What if I, okay, there you go. Good job, you're not starving anymore. <laughs> like, like I hate how if you focus on production, they literally will not do anything else. Like I feel like at a bare minimum, they should know, like when I say focus on production, I don't mean at the cost of your own livelihood. Like, we're not, <laughs> we're not capitalist, right? Like, what, what's our government? We're, uh, we're communist. Yeah, like, y'all, you know, contrary to popular belief, you actually can have food in a communist <laughs> empire. <laughs> like, y'all need to starve yourself to death by working in the mines. This isn't, like, Cuba or, like, you know, the, the USSR, all right? <laughs> this is, like, a, like a Norway-style communist country. Oh, we're making Launston Catholic. That's good. So all of all of Australia. No, never mind. Canberra. Canberra is still purple wheel, but all of you know tolerable Australia is now Catholic. I see La Rochelle is gonna convert. What is that? 19 turns? To what? To to Launston? Like is that actually gonna convert over to Australia just because of this? See, that don't make sense to me. Like, I feel like the 6, the 7, the 8... Like, I feel like La Rochelle should not be having loyalty issue. Or is it? Yeah, look. That's fucking wild to me. Like, you can see the three blue ones representing, like I said, Rowan, Renz, and uh, Toulouse. But Launston, by itself, like, it's not even getting extra from, like, Toowoomba or anything. It's purely just Launston doing that. The way you can tell, I think it's like, uh, I don't think the arrow size matters. I think the arrows are all the same size, but it's the speed and the uh, frequency of them. So like launched in, you can see like just constant uh, arrows, whereas these ones have more gaps and stuff. So it's a very weird metric to measure loyalty by how fast the arrows come at me. But, but yeah, that's, that's loyalty. Wait, where the fuck are they playing music at? I thought I... I thought I banned music. Why do I still hear it? Am I hearing... Am I hearing this one? The... The rival puppies? <laughs> am I... Am I hearing the puppies? I feel like... I feel like fucking... Jerry Lawler now. But for real, why am I... Why am I hearing rock music? I banned it! I banned that fucking devil music! I banned it! Okay, now finish sending age. Very CIA of them. Uh, what, what am I at for that? Fuck it! Fucking Cree is gonna come out from under me and take that. Do I, how badly do I want it? I mean, I wanted it for the two Diplo points, but then I got fucked with all the other stuff. I guess I can just go ahead and send. Like, the AI doesn't seem to know how to, like, send money for her. So I'll send her, like, a few hundred just to get my point up. If, if he's willing to actually send her, like, more than that, then whatever. He can have it. It's no, it's no big deal. I went ahead and put down a diplomatic quarter in Vatican. 
<laughs> I never build these. It's probably too late for it to be like effective. But like I don't know. <laughs> I wanna I wanna have one. And it's gonna take six turns and it'll give me an envoy. So <laughs> I feel like Vatican is a good like central part of it. And it'll be right next to Gilgamesh, which has been like my long term buddy. So I feel like it kind of makes sense. Like I kind of see my empire in three different parts. Like here's like my home empire. This was like my first expansion empire. This is where like I took like a lot of, I took like half of Sumeria. I took like over a couple city states. I took like some of, uh, I took like this free city. Like this was like my first little territorial expansion empire. And then over here is like former Australia. <laughs> It's like the three sectors of this would be a Stellaris. You know, I just now realized we are back up to like 300 gold too. Like we were at like 160. So one of our uh, trade deals must have ended. Like one of those ones where it's like, oh, have 100 gold per turn and give me a fucking clock. <laughs> one of those trade deals must have expired. So we're actually gaining money again. Oh, we got nanotech. All right. Didn't we boost that like a long time ago? Now I think about it. <laughs> Like, we boosted that a long time ago, but we finally got it. How hard would it be with nukes and giant death robots to wipe everyone out? I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna click it. We're gonna leave it there in the tech tree. And we're gonna see what happens. Because giant death robots can move really fast fast like they don't really suffer i don't think any movement penalties at all like they can like crush literally not even a jazz ring they can probably go from poznan to akin in like two turns like they can crush the ocean like nothing i don't think they even suffer like a embark or disembark penalty so if i really needed to send a death robot through this lovely little like canal I made between the fog of war and send it right smack dab into the middle of uh, the Kree's little, their little second sector of, uh, of cities. I could probably just wipe these out. Like, like wipe out the spaceport, wipe out, uh, is that the, I thought they had another one down here. I keep seeing all these fucking solar farms, and I keep thinking all these fucking solar farms are spaceports, but they're not. <laughs> they're just, they're just solar farms. But they look, they look similar, right? You know, <laughs> they, they're, they're both phallic. That's my argument. I like to think this railroad I made, you know, the reason it doesn't affect these tiles is because it's kind of like a lovely ride through the country, right? Like, this isn't like the type of rail that you take coal on this is like the type of rail that like uh amtrak uses right this is like the kind of train you pay like 500 dollars for just to like sit for like 10 hours and ship some coffee and read a book next to your wife while you like look out and be like oh look look at all the trees honey isn't this lovely it's like that kind of a train ride you know Oh, religious spread eliminates. Yeah, always go prathathathizer when it's an option. Always prathathathizer. Did I get it again? Uh, debate, 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 debater. I love debating. I love it. I love mass debating. <laughs> that's, such, that's such a bad joke, but I love it. Why do I have a naturalist? Did I click this instead of a partial? Did I fuck up? Did I did I accidentally click naturalist? I don't have anything for you, girl. Where are you? I don't have anything for you. Um I'm sorry. I don't know where I don't know where to put you. Like this this don't count anymore. Can you go over here possibly? No? Like right like right here? What? Breathtaking? Like, this would all be breathtaking, but no one owns all this. I can take Laventa and then build one here. <laughs> I'm sorry. Maybe once, uh, maybe once the, the, what's this? What's this called? Maybe once the Eiffel Tower is done, it'll, uh, open up more spots for me to move you. Who are you? Bayaya 
Will Marantne? Will Marantne? Vajaya. Sorry if y'all can hear my, my dog barking downstairs. Born in Colombo? Colombo? What the fuck is his name? Born in blah in Colombo, Vanagamuni Adarjev Vayakamar Mendes Wamaratna, or just Vajaya. <laughs> oh, Sri Lanka. Okay. All right. I understand now. They're from Sri Lanka. That's what I was confused. I just, I like that name. I could not place like the origins of that name. Okay, they're Sri Lankan. And yes, I only know about Sri Lanka because of Nicki Minaj. Chew me. I'm a I'm a barb. I can't help it. Roll up in my Tonka color. Oh, Willy Wonka. I'm going to build a seaport here just so I can get more tile porn. Like, look at this. Look at look at all look at all them yields. Ah, ah. Yeah, I'm going to build a seaport just for more tile porn. I dress you from Milan. That's the monster to do. And I'll open your face with just your face. And then you're going to make my money ain't. And I don't care if they call me fake because my money ain't. First things first, I'll eat your brain. Then I'll start rocking gold teeth with fangs. That's what a motherfucking monster do. Gold dress from a lawn. That's the monster do. You know, da, 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 face. I don't care. They call me fake. Cause my money ain't. Eh. Why is Buenos Aires getting so much, uh, so much food, but nothing else? I built sewers here. Cause I knew they're gonna have housing issues. But they literally like already surpassed the amount of housing they got from building the sewers. <laughs> like, like look at all these fucking farms. I'm tempted to just. Like, raise a couple, just so they feel the struggle that the rest of my empire feels. Like, Sydney up here, if I take them off food, look, they're like, they don't know what to do. They can't have babies anymore. It's like a fucking Chinese uh, policy from the 90s right now. But if I put them on food, you know, then everything else sucks. But they have to be focused on food. But anyways, air is down here, like, 10 tiles away. They're fucking living it up, feasting every night like kings. And I'm Jadviga. So I don't know why. I feel disrespected the fact that they're feasting like kings. Here's this. A French rocket launcher? Am I at war with France? No. So why do you have a rocket launcher on my doorsteps, you crazy psycho bitch? Like, like, if you want to buy some oranges, you can just trade. You don't have to send them over here to, like, pick them up from the fucking farmer's market. Where'd they go? Do they just disappear into... Is, our, is Brisbane a fucking, like, sanction city? Like, what, what's happening? Did I... Oh, did I win? Let go! Get fucked, Kree! Get fucked! Okay, I got the two diplomatic points. Cool, cool, cool. Cool, cool. That... How many do I have now? I know I said I wasn't going for any more, but I'm still excited that I won. Okay, I'm back up to 13. Let go! Net, net profit of zero! <laughs> We're pogging. You know, I think I might have enough gold to get the Eiffel Tower now. Because I have 24, I need like 12 more, and I would get 12 when I pop you. Hey, one turn left. Okay, cool. I, I did the math right. I did the I did that quick math. Oh, <gasps> immediate Catholic? Are you the? You're not even the prophesizer. Boom, immediate Catholic. Nanakujikua is now <laughs> Catholic. Let go. They're about to immediately turn back to a uh, eastern orthodoxy after hearing that abysmal pronunciation they're like oh no fuck fuck your religion you can't even pronounce your city right famous than i am oh gustav we love you gustav we love you i love like the the cliche french music in the background this thing is terrifying by the way oh you see the top of it you can go up there and it's like so shaky it's terrifying. It, it It's genuinely scary to be up there, especially if you're scared of heights. Like, this tower wobbles. Like, you wouldn't be able to tell from the bottom, but when you get up there to, like, the tip, that shit fucking wobbles like hell. Did that, like, give me any national parts? Let me grab my naturalist. I'm looking. I'm, I'm let down. I'm disappointed. <gasps> Over here! Bur send them! Go to Adelaide! Go to Adelaide and look, they're going to use my tunnel. They're using my tunnel. Ah, ah, oh, that's awesome. I knew it was going to come in handy. Right, yeah, yeah, go over to Adelaide. Adelaide, you're getting a national park, buddy. Bro, look at this water park. 
<laughs> I, just, I just put down this water park to try to get more tourism and stuff. You, you already knew the vibe. But, like, it created a gap in the flood barrier, and now it's like you can kind of walk across. It's actually kind of cool. Like, it kind of created, like, a little walking path between, like, the tower and, like, over here. I love that. Oh, yeah, now you can just go up to Yolundi. Oh, they're still going to be Eastern Orthodox, but that's okay. You have a, you have a buddy coming to help you out. Oh shit, he's already here. Is it him? Oh look! Boom! They're atheists now. Bro, their little uh, thing is so cool. Yeah, they're a Kandi. Like, that's such a cool encampment. Atomic Era ends in 8 turns? Well, that's no good. Oh, he stole smart materials! Awesome. Am I gonna get a Golden Age? It ends in 8 turns. I need 7 more Era to get another Golden Age. I need seven points. What can I do to get seven points? Like, I've already, like, been building all my railroads and stuff. Does building, like, a missile silo help out? <laughs> can I just build a missile silo? Do I get points for being a terrorist? I really would prefer getting another Golden Age if I can. Didn't I, like, just get points? Where is it? I got four for Eiffel. Yeah, I did like a a total water park. Is there any if there are any like districts I haven't built everything in that like I already have? Like I think I've already did like a max seaport and stuff. Right? Like where where's this one? Yeah, like this has like all all the stuff it needs. What about like my encampments? Do they have everything? Yeah. Uh it's gonna suck. I don't really know if I can get anything. Do I get era score for getting another themed museum? Like, let me uh, trade this stuff in Bidgo. Yeah, give me give me the marriage. Do you have another one that's cooler? You got the Holy Grail? You motherfucker. I want that. I also I want the death of Cleopatra for sure. And uh, give me give me this give me Pieta. Give me Pieta, Death of Cleopatra. I'll give you I don't know the two that I don't like. Uh, Marie Ka. Uh, you can have Pierre and and Carhart. I want Catherine the second. Twenty five. Yeah, that's fair. That's fair, I guess. Yo, can I have the Holy Grail? How much will you? No, no circumstances. You will give me the Grail. Is it because I don't have room? Like, is that is that why? Like, is it actually that you don't want to give it to me, or is it I don't have any room for it? It looks like I don't have room for it. Wait, whoa, 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 Cologne has room for a book. I have a book in my palace. Yo, yo, smart, giga brain, sad brain. I can put, I can put a relic in my palace. Get over here, Hojo. Get over here. Give me that grail. Give me that grail, baby. <coughs> oh my God. Oh my God, my voice. <coughs> I hurt my throat. I'm just so excited. I'm so excited to have the Holy Grail. Oh, man. Oh, man. That's awesome. There's going to be like a fucking exploding bunny hiding in this or some shit. It's going to be sabotage for sure, but I don't care. I'm happy. I got the fucking Holy Grail, baby. Oh, wait. Right here. Right here. Like one turn until I get digital democracy. And I should get points for uh, the first like tier whatever government, right? Oh, yeah. Here we go. So first tier three is two, but oh god, I got rid of it. Oh wait, no, no. It's, I think it's tier four, right? It it would be two normally. If it's the first one, it's three. So that'd be three. Put me up to forty-seven. Plus, if the naturalist can get there, that would be enough. Oh wait, right here, green improvement. I don't think I've got this. Build its first tile improvement dedicated to providing energy. So if I build a windmill. That'll help, right? Like, if I build a windmill right here, that should give me, like, brownie points. I want to build it right here. Just because I feel like it'd look cooler right there. I didn't get there? Oh, yeah, he can get there in a turn. Yeah, build it right here in the middle of all these, like, mines. And I'll pretend that it's powering all of them. You know, I'm kind of tempted. Kind of similar to how I built the... The... Whatchamacallit? The diplomatic quarter in Vatican? Oh, shit, it's done, by the way. 
Uh, I'm building an aerodrome in Krakow just to have it. Just to have it, honestly. Because I, I can build, like, airports probably pretty quickly. And maybe use it to help get troops between, like, you and maybe if I can get one out quickly in, like, Rockhampton or something. You know, just to, like, have, like, airports, basically. Not really going to use it for, like, planes, I guess. Aside from commercial planes. Yeah. <laughs> but I don't really need, I don't need, like, fighters or jets or nothing. But speaking of Vatican and uh, the diplomatic order, so what do these do? I always like, I never fuck with it. I receive one for each delegation or embassy from a, okay. So this is probably going to give me more diplomatic favors. I do have a lot of embassies and stuff. And then plus one envoy it built next. Okay, I did build it next to there. Enemy spies operate at two levels below targeting, targeting this district or adjacent. So I probably should have put it in Indonesia instead. But, but that's fine. <laughs> that's fine. Um, I could always like build a commercial hub here or something. Like I'd always build something else around you, just to like make that part of it more important. But what's this stuff? Okay, two influence per turn. Oh, it just by itself just gives me a bunch of gold giants. Wow, I should probably like build these, huh? Like especially like early game. Like, right now, it don't really matter, but early game, just those, like, tile, or just those yields would, like, help out a lot, honestly. <laughs> uh, and plus, like, the two influence to get more envoys. I feel like I should just, I, I should probably build this more often than I do. <laughs> and then, what, enemy spies reduce one when attacking the city, or cities with encampments. Okay, I do have a lot of encampments. And then, uh, when, when they capture a spy, receive 50 signs for every level. Again, that's really not important. But I feel like it's almost worth building these just to get more influence points. Because I always kind of wish I would get more influence points than I do. So yeah, I should probably build these more often. I'm going to head. I'm gonna go ahead and just buy the consulate building. And then start working on the chancery. Isn't there, like, stuff that gets boosted by that too? Like, is it, is it the industrial ones? Yeah, plus two production if a factory or a consulate building. When producing one there's blah, blah, blah. So yeah, the industrial ones. Oh, it's all of them. All of them are blank, blank, or uh, consulate. So I guess fucking Vatican's going to get a bunch of benefit now. Oh, wow. The entirety of Geelong wants to flood. <laughs> okay. Man, why y'all want to starve? Ah, uh, fine, fine. Work on food. But yeah, the entirety of Geelong is going to fucking flood. I need to get a builder over here and repair all this stuff. <laughs> Give them like a little bit extra production or something. Well, you're, de you're a debater, aren't you? What if I use the other guy? Oh, Catholic! Ah, 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 you're Catholic. Ah, oh, get fucked. Get fucked. Ah, oh, you're Catholic. And then come over here and convert this guy. I feel like that's the worst type of missionary you can have. Like someone comes to your door with like a Bible or whatever. They convert you. Like they genuinely convince you. To be like Christian or something, right? Or, or Catholic, whatever. And then you like convert, you go get baptized, whatever. And then you meet them a couple months later. And they're like, wait, you actually fell for it? You're actually Catholic now? Ah, oh, get fucked. Oh, it was a prank. It was a prank. Ah, oh, you actually believe in Jesus now? Ah, oh, get fucked. <laughs> like, you know how PM that would be? <laughs> if someone like actually converted you, but then said it was a prank. That'd be, that'd be fucked. <laughs> An enemy spy has eluded in Krakow? Krakow? Don't you have an encampment? Don't you have an encampment, Krakow? Oh, you don't. Oh, that's why you don't have an encampment. That's why y'all are sucking. I need to build an encampment now just to make uh, people less likely to attack me. Oh, I, I successfully pillaged the spaceport. Let's go. Let's go. Get fucked. We also did end up getting digital democracy. So what do I do now? Probably this. I can boost it by getting adopt a government with 10 inherent policies. Is that not just what I'm about to do? Like that not just like this, right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yeah. So go down to this. Two amenities, two culture. What's my culture going to go to? What's my science and stuff going to drop to though? Hmm. Okay, let's look. Oh! Oh, that hurt. That hurt and was like 
orgasmic. Like, my culture broke a thousand, but my science dropped like a hundred. Damn. Damn. I mean, yeah, look at this. Like, it's all, <laughs> it's all <laughs> wild cards now. Plus, per city state, I'm choose Reign of. That could help. Because that will get me back my... I'm at least use reign of two, of two city states. So that will get me my 10% back. Oh, and the culture as well. Boom. Is there anything else I need? Like, I already... It kept the rock band. What else did I have? Oh, yeah, and then I still need this stuff. Where is it? Uh, Towards people I have a trade route with? Online communities? Yeah, get them fucking forums popping. What else? Do I still have the, the tourism... For heritage? Yeah, yeah, okay, here it is. Whatever it was called. Yeah, heritage tourism. I got it backwards, but we we do still have that. Maybe this for more money. Oh, e-commerce? Two production, five gold on all trade routes? I mean shit, combine both of these. Yeah. You start mass sending trade routes to everyone. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna confirm. I don't think I'm missing anything. I'm double checking. I'm pressing the button. Boom. What, what happened? Okay, we went back up to 700 now. We also, yeah, like our, our money went up to like almost 600. It was at like four something. Cool, cool. And we are back up to plus 14. Okay, good. I don't know why it dropped to like minus eight. I was so worried. But we're good. And we did get the Aris War, right? Yeah, we did. We got plus four out of it, actually. Did we build Taj Mahal? We did. All right. I was like, wait a minute. I totally forgot we had Taj Mahal. I was like, why did I get four when I read it and it said three? But also, you right here. Give me this clean energy, buddy. Golden Age. Look at it. Ah, we got a Golden Age. Okay, good. Good, good, good. We don't have to worry about being one of them normal plebeians <laughs> with your normal age. We get to keep our golden banner up top. And yeah, that did boost you in one turn. So after you, we have like a whole lot of new stuff to explore. A lot of this stuff late game should be stuff that boosts like tourism and stuff like that. It's kind of like a like late game, all these unrevealed tech like this should help with winning culturally. While as the tech tree late game helps out with pretty much domination, kind of because a lot of these as you can show uh, passively boost ro robots like this is a giant death robots are stronger <laughs> this is giant death robots are stronger etc so oh but speaking of trade routes though i got a new one here because of our mog where should i where should i get it from like who do i i need a trade route with with these guys i don't know how to get to them would the best bet be from poznan i'm gonna i'm gonna try i'm gonna see whether i can send them a trade route from poznan oh i don't have the money yet is anyone willing to give me like 300 bucks? Who loves me the most? Hammurabi, are you willing to give me like $300? What if I give you Diplo? Okay, okay, okay. Progress. What? How much do I need to give you to get 300? A4? Pleasure doing business with you, pal. Pleasure doing business with you. It just, it, like, like for me, I'm not about one more turn. I'm about right now. Did I do the... Hi, I'm back. So, um, I'm stupid and don't know how to math, unfortunately. Can I have a little bit more money? Wait, it's, it says I have 770. How much do I need? 850. God damn it. <laughs> That's probably, I, I, I think sevens or eights for some reason. All right. So you give me literally 100. How much of this do you want? Click, click, click 30. All right. I know I could have got 27 or whatever. It's it's not a big deal. He, he's a homeboy. I'm not going to lowball him. I'm not going to Facebook marketplace this shit. Have your like couple extra freebies. Oh, my guy has to escape after blowing up the... The spaceport. But he did escape. Cool. Did he get a promotion or anything? Uh oh, I guess not. He deserves one. Uh did my naturalists already make it through? Oh yeah, they're like up here now. Okay. I was trying to like get my military engineer to slowly walk down here. I was hoping to like have this completed before someone walked through it. But that's fine. 
I don't know. Yeah, I don't know if y'all really been noticing. I mentioned it a couple times, but like in the background, in between turns, I just been like building this massive railway <laughs> network. Like I mentioned a couple parts ago. Like I got this guy. He's made it from Newcastle all the way up to Perth by now. And this dude, I started him at Larrick, and he went all the way down and around through Legnica, and he's about to finally connect to Krakow. And at that point, I don't really know what I'm going to do with him. <laughs> Maybe send him back up here and connect it from, like, Larrick over to this incense or something. Now I think about it, didn't you have, like, a settler you were trying to go somewhere with? Did you ever get that, like, figured out? <laughs> Did you ever get, like, a settler to go anywhere? What, what's Nagajarma doing all the way up here, by the way? Like, should I be worried about that? Are they just up there by themselves? Or what? Wait, Yulu launched a, launched a satellite? Damn. You know, I should probably launch a satellite just so I can see where everything is. Yeah, because I don't have, like, bar barbarian clans on. So it's kind of weird that a city state spawn way up there by itself. Normally, I feel like they don't spawn up in, like, the tundra. Where's my, where's my trade route guy? Here we go. Can I send you? Oh, I can't. He doesn't want to go over there. Where are you willing to go? Are you willing to go over to like... Oh, you are willing to go to Hungary. Okay, perfect, perfect. I'll just send you this way, I guess. Yeah, go to Buda. Where are they? Where are they? Oh, look for the green. Here we go. Uh, yeah, you get more for going to Buda. Should do that. But that trade route, that's going to be huge right there. By the way, how many more turns do I have until the spaceport's done? 15 here, 11 here. All right, 11, 15. When those are done, I can send up at least an Earth satellite. And I got 12 turns for fucking Operation... <laughs> Operation Thermonuclear. Or what's it? Isn't it like Operation Ivy? Yeah, Operation Ivy. I got... Look, it's all going to compete at the... Or it's all going to complete at the same turn. <laughs> spaceport for science victory. Uh, <laughs> thermo nuke for domination. That means y'all got 12 turns until I seriously start thinking about nuking you guys. So you might want, you know, to let me win sooner rather than later. Oh, Seastead? Oh, I love Seastead. Oh, and we get a Diplo. That's right. Yeah, some of the shine stuff gives you, like, Diplo victory points. So that'll put me up to 14. And also, as I said, Seasteads are just so cool to build. And we got near future govern... govern... gun... We got near future governance. All right. Uh, yeah, I can't read what these do. But I see you have a little star symbol. And little star symbol means victory point. Or, well, it means passive. And in this case, it means victory point. So that's going to put us at 15, baby. Let go. Catholic. Hey, hey, hey. Let go. Let go. Okay. Now, now I should have majority Yulu. Right? Right? Where is it? Motherfucker. Motherfucker, what do you... 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 1, 2, 3, 4. Okay, next turn, it's going to update. <laughs> and I'm going to have Max with him, right? I'm waiting for it to pop up and be like, Oh, uh, our, our reporter has reported that we have religious supremacy over the Yulu. Ah, right? Right? Or it's going to pop up and say that there's a dust storm in Buenos Aires. You know, same thing, different shape, I guess, really. Ah, look, look at it, the little, the little brown shield icon. Look at it, ah, 4 out of 10. I don't know where they plan on setting the Shedler, though. Like, <laughs> do they have anywhere they can BM me with a Shedler? I guess here. I guess they can put a Shedler, like, over here. Or down here, if they really wanted to BM. <laughs> I swear to God, if someone puts a, sh a shitty right here, I'll be so mad. I, I keep thinking about putting in a shitty here, but I never did. I mean, it'd be cool for, like, the, the turtles out there. An allied reports Shumeria is beginning a military assault on Poland? Last ten turns? One, two, three, four, five, six. For the last six turns, they've been planning a military assault? Are you sure about that? Like, like, we're allied. Like, I know that there's, like, the, the, there's the betrayal thing, but I already pieced out with all of them, so they can't win it. <laughs> like, I think we're okay, right? You know, I can build a commercial hub in Valley, though. And it would be a plus five right here, apparently. I forgot about having, like, Machu Picchu and stuff. Like, I can build, <laughs> yeah, I can build one over here in Valley. That will be nice. 
Just to, like, again, help me get, like, more trade routes. I might as well. Like, fuck it. I also don't have anything over here in Canal. So, yeah, go ahead and get me a harbor here. Look, it's, like, the connecting harbor. That's cool. But, yeah, I can do a lighthouse here. That'll give me more trade routes. I'm basically just trying to get, like, as many trade routes as I can. Because it'll probably be easier just to make a new trade route than it will be to wait for one of them to come back. So, I, I pretty much just need to, uh, yeah, send trade routes everywhere. Because that, that should help me, like, since the victory, right? Oh, I think it's finally connected. I, I went ahead and, like, I built it before commentating. But, but yeah, I think I think it's connected. I For whatever reason, I keep thinking that you can stand in the mountain. So I, I, I thought about, like, like next turn it would be completed because I would have to stand in the mountain to build a railroad. But, no, it's, it's, it's finally completed. I got a railroad going from Valley all the way up through Krakow. To Laric. Look at that. Look at that. How quickly can someone, like, make that journey now? If I click on my uh, guy here. Like, he can get from Ganesio up to Legnica in, like, one turn. That's, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. And I did get another spy here in Canal. I think I might use you to counter spy. I'm not sure. Like, if I put you in Krakow and put you in, put you in here... I think they can, by by default, they get all the adjacent ones, right? Okay, yeah, I'm right. By default, it does do adjacent districts. And I know someone was attacking Krakow. So I think I will just do that. I think I'll just move you to Krakow, defend the commercial hub so they can't siphon money, and then by default, that will protect the holy site, the campus, the, the neighborhood, so they won't spawn terrorists, and it'll protect the, uh, the harbor. So, the, so, you know, they might fuck around and steal some of my great works, but uh, I probably should put them there. But I feel like for the most part, the AI siphons money. Man, I just realized I've, I've been completely forgetting about fucking uh, rock bands. <laughs> I've been completely forgetting about rock bands. Yeah, I should probably go back to focusing on those. Like, I got so distracted thinking about, oh, like converting converting the Zulu into my religion and stuff like that and trying to spread my religion I completely forgot about rock bands which are like the best end game way to get tourism tourism uh period <laughs> just, just put a period there uh yeah it's like the best way to get tourism in late game and I just completely was like oh I gotta convert I gotta make everyone catholic I need to <laughs> it's like no nah, man what am I what am I doing what am I doing I'm so stupid yeah, like that, I mean, it just gives you, like, a shit ton of tourism. I mean, I'm not wrong about, like, Apostle still help. Like, spreading religion does still help. It just probably not as much as, you know, <laughs> uh, rock music does. Although I know a lot of these people have it banned. Like, Japan, I think, has it banned. I think one of these other people might. I guess we'll find out. Barbarians moved in? Where? Oh. Oh. Honestly, they can... They can have it. I don't really, I don't really care. Oh, I'm dominant over France. Awesome. Yeah, they can, they can have it. I don't, I don't mind. Y'all do you. Pink Machine, Enlightened League, Night Faith, Tam Bell, Extreme Empire. Yeah, yeah, Extreme. Performing a conjure causes to lose loyalty. That seems like BM. I'm just gonna take Popstar, honestly. Like, I don't think I can flip any of these people. You know. Like, I don't think I'm in a position where, like, I can use that rock band and really help me flip. Like, maybe, like, Uma or something. But I don't think they even got anything for me to play at. Oh, my naturalist made it. Build the improvement. Ah! Ah! Adelaide National Park. I probably I should have waited, huh? Yeah, three turns. It's fine. Like, honestly, if I don't beat the game by the time the next era ends, I don't deserve to win. <laughs> so, give me Adelaide National Park. I love it. I love it. Is there a way for me to connect these? Oh, I don't think there is anymore. Like, like I could. I don't think you can double up, right? Yeah. So these are just like uh, slightly out of reach now. I do really want to make a game, like a Pangea game or something, where I just try to build like the biggest national park I possibly can. Ooh, Wolin now, atheist. I saw. I saw Wolin with like green cross. I just want Wolin, just you know. To help spread my stuff a little bit more. I just want everyone around me to be my religion. Alright. Like. Up here. 
you know, Humeria, they're firmly mine. I want the Hulu to be firmly, like, mine. These guys, they can do what they want. If they want to worship Green God instead of Red God, that's their prerogative. But Hulu, they're like my best bud. They should be, they should be my religion. I don't want us arguing over, you know, Red God versus Green God at Thanksgiving or anything like that. So, Zulu needs to get on board. Oh, I captured a spy? Yo! Bro, look at that! Perfect timing! As soon as I put my spy here, I captured one. Did I say it was from the Zulu? Wasn't I just talking about how we were friends? What would you give it for it back? Not even bad, to be honest. <laughs> like, 20 gold? For 70 turns. It's honestly like not that bad. <laughs> I feel like it's not enough. Like, I want like 100 per turn or something. But it's a lot more than I kind of thought. Like Matthias used to be like, ah, fuck it. Murder him. I don't care. Throw him in the dungeon. You can do what you want. I ain't paying for him back. He means nothing to me. And I'm like, damn. Damn, you. You a different breed, Matthias. You a different breed. Okay, here's my extreme rules band. Where should I go? What are you good for? Just anywhere? I guess I'll send you to Paris. Or I'm already good with Paris, aren't I? Wait, can I actually... Can I play in Japan? Do they, do they get rid of their little rule? Okay, I'll come down here and play in Japan then. I think... I don't think I'm dominant over them. Like, I, I just got the message I'm dominant over... Over Paris. So I feel like I should go places where I'm not dominant. To become dominant so I get more, right? Is that how, is that how it works? Like, I'm getting... 40 from you. No, no, I should go to... I probably should go to uh, Catherine. I'm only getting 28 there. Alright, I'll, I'll redo it then. <laughs> Hold on. Cancel movement. Go over to, like, Renz instead. Wait, do I have two people here? Oh, no, you're the one that had to run away. That's right. But yeah, Gregors. You still need to go back there and counter spy. You need to... Go somewhere so you can disrupt rocketry again. Go to, uh, t like, the word, the word Philadelphia, if you put it through a fucking paper shredder. Yeah, go here. Hey, Wolin is now Catholic. It looks so good on you. Like, look, red text, red dragon, griffin icon, red cross. It's great. You got red soldiers. Like, like you, you were meant to be Catholic. You, you got red borders, too. I'm telling you, perfect. Uh, oh, global warming mitigation. Cool. Oh, I got two diplomatic victory points. Oh, yeah, because, uh, <laughs> global warming. Nice. I don't know how you get victory points for that, though. I feel like all it does is make people argue, <laughs> unfortunately. Okay, rock band. What did I say? Yeah, go play at a wrench fair in wrench in the theater square. <laughs> bars, bars. I think I'm going to build a, a settler. Get me a settler. There's a reason for it, I, sh I swear. These people are, like, starting to be over pop anyway. So get me a settler. And I don't have any, I don't think I have enough money for anything else. Oh, I can buy more, uh, more rock bands. I guess, yeah, just buy them, like, Hobart and keep sending them over to, to Paris. There we go. But if there's enough time before we win, I would like to probably come down here and settle somewhere in the snow so that I can build the best wonder in the entire game. <laughs> Maybe I might be able to build the best wonder in the entire game before we win. Maybe. I'm going to try to send a, a settler down there and see what happens. Oh yeah, I got communist legacy. I forgot about that. I could do a plus 0.6 production per citizen in cities with governors. I could pop that down. I mean, it would help out. Like that'd be what? Uh, 0.6 per... So if there's 15 people here, it'd be 15 times 0.6, which would be 6... Uh, it'd be like 7 or 8. It'd be like 7 or 8 extra production. Quick math, quick math, man. I don't got paper and pen. <laughs> it'd be like 7 or 8, probably. What happened, by the way? Golden Age? Golden Age? Pog? Get rid of all these notifications. There we go. The only ones are me and, me and Gilgamesh. Bro, Gilgamesh. You're my dude, man. You're my dude. So, last time we took this, 
and maybe it actually helped because we just went down from like 16 something down to like 1490 so that might have actually been helping uh the alternatives we got sky and stars i don't think i've ever really seen these ones uh, spies take no time time to complete all reduced what is this eureka is for smart materials productive what what are we in right now we're in the information so unlock the eureka for satellite nana we already have all that so this is like useless gain oh <gasps> you get a free death robot three uranium per turn uranium mines accumulate more bruh do we go <laughs> for tourism or do we just get the free robot free robot what would i do with the robot well well i would probably <laughs> turn my site back on canberra and brisbane take these out they can keep those i don't know what would i do with a death robot i feel like late game it wouldn't do too much and i'd be disappointed alternatively oh wow look at fucking look at is fajayir like, look at the flood barriers around the entire... They got two layers of walls now. They got their city wall and the flood barrier wall. A giant death robot, though? Like, bruh, bruh. I could just, like, storm roll these guys. Uh, you know what? If I really want one, I can build it pretty quickly. Or I can buy it and save up, like, 9k and buy one pretty quickly. I'll go for the tourism. I'll go for the tourism. If I need a death robot... I can get one pretty quick. What do we name our rock band? Uh, favorite part of the game. I just hit this a lot of times and see what I get. Uh, stop. Magic Princess. <laughs> uh, Music Fest. Yeah, National Parks and stuff. That's great. I wasn't, I wasn't going to be Cheap Diamonds. I'm not going to be Cubic Chitonium. That's not going to be my band name. I'll be fucking Magic Pink princess on a pony anything's better than <laughs> anything's better than cheap diamonds the fuck like look look the game's even telling me this is all prime location or i mean fresh water at least where should we actually settle i'm thinking like here but i guess it doesn't get access to water then actually like like i can't build a harbor maybe like maybe like here put it like here between the two oil i can do like a harbor here or something if i need It'll be great. Or I could do like commercial hub harbor. It'll be it'll be it'll be good. It'll be good. Oh man. My apostle died and this is still not not Catholic. Is it gonna like convert soon or no, wow, it's being affected by everything. Damn, that's like the melting pot of, of the game right now. Like that's that's the America. <laughs> oh here we go. Music fest. Lego! See, that's why, that's why I'm like, what's the point? Like, what, what's the point in trying with rock bands when they generate, like, 200 tourism and then die? Oh, shit, I captured another, another one. Wow. Again, from Zulu, and again, trying to fucking <laughs> spawn terrorists in my capital. What the hell? What the hell? Now I'm going to have to, like, move him back. Well, I'm going to promote him. And then moving back, but still. Oh, look. Uh, if this spy is in home, all my other spies are better. Thank you, Zulu. Thank you for helping me uh, fuck up the Kree even more. <laughs> I appreciate you, buddy. The, the Kree, they're actually just helping me out. Or Zulu, they're actually, like, helping me out. They're, like, pretending to steal my stuff. When in reality, they're just, like, helping me grind XP. I got four envoys. Oh, my, bro, I'm gaining so many envoys now. Is this because of my influence? It's like every few turns I got like so many. What do I what do I want? More gold wouldn't be bad. Just more more and more gold. I mean I guess more uh like getting Shinkuti wouldn't be bad. Uh, trade routes give me faith as well as just getting more faith so I can buy more apostles and stuff. I like that idea. Yeah, make me huge rain, and that also gives me more shines because of that uh, policy card. So yeah, there we go. All right, Magic Princess, what's your upgrade again? 
Nas national parks. Is it Wonders 2? And Natural Wonders. Um, hmm, I don't think they have any of those. <laughs> I'm looking at, like, all the things that are lighting up. I don't see any Natural Wonders. Like, I know I have Mount Rama. Is there any, like, National Parks? They don't really have any. They have, like, Normal Wonders. Like, I'm looking. Like, I don't see, like, Matterhorn or anything like that. Wait, isn't there a Yuluru? Wait, right here. Yuluru. Yeah. Can't you perform that better? Like, it says natural wonders, but you're not allowed to, like, walk on a natural wonder. Performs and natural wonders for... So, is it only allowed to be, like, Fountain of Youth, basically? Okay. Make your way down to the Fountain of Youth, then. Because that's pretty much the only place you're going to get that benefit. <laughs> oh, hi, Clara. I don't really have anywhere for you to go, girl. I don't really have, like, broadcast centers anymore. <laughs> Wasn't I building one up here in, like, Sydney? Yeah, I guess you can go up there if you really want. You can just wait that out. Yeah, just do that, Home Slice. Just, just go to go to Sydney, I guess. Uh, uh, what the fuck was that? Where, where are you going, Shumeria? Where are you? Where, where? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me, let me end my turn. Hold up. I don't care about anything else right now. Where are you taking... Is this your military assault? <laughs> like, you, you're gonna forward settle me? Like, where, where can you settle? You can settle there. And steal the aluminum and the geothermal from me. Which would be an actual thing to do. I don't care about... I, I'm telling you, I don't care about anything else but this right now. You can settle here. And, you know, be grateful that I'm building a flood barrier so it don't flood. You can come over here, I guess. Like, honestly, if he settled right here, I would not be too upset. If he, like, settled here, I'm gonna be upset. I'm gonna be upset. I'm gonna be upset. If he settles, like, here, I won't be too upset. Because it's kind of, like, in between my stuff. Like, Buenos Aires. One, two, three... Like, it could reach this oil, but I don't really desperately need it. If we settle here to have a little port in the Gulf, aside from Shapar, I wouldn't be too mad. But we'll see. Oh! The sea has risen! Did I lose anything? Oh, you didn't... Did you finish the flood barrier? I don't think... I don't think Ganesio finished the flood barrier. Oh, no, they didn't. That's such a cool little, like... What are the two little... Two little, like, tit buildings? <laughs> what are those? No! All this stuff... Is flooded. Is it permanently? Have been permanently flooded. I thought there was a way to, like... Unflood them. Is anywhere else flooded? I'm, like, looking along the coast to see if anything else has been, like, fucked up. As the Wait, wait, wait! Armok! No! No, I, I like, I was, you know, going by and then my eye caught it. The fire. No! My theater square under, under construction. <laughs> oh, my, my check on E. The, the fucking, the water park's fine. The water park's like, oh, we're happy as hell. The water got closer. No! <laughs> You're telling me there's no way to fix that? Cannot repair location flooded? Who? No. Who did this? Who's at fault? Go to the little rain cloud. Who's at fault for this? Who, who's dark red? And most of it is because of, um, because of coal, huh? Well, who the fuck keeps using, who the fuck keeps using all this coal? Who the fuck keeps using coal to do all this? Oh. I'm sorry, Armog. I'm sorry. 
I promised I would take care of you when I took you over and I let you down. No. No, I just built that Chuck on Egypt stuff too. No, I'm gonna I'm down a traitor now. No, Armog, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh that sucks. Well on that note, I'm gonna end the video there. <laughs> Thank you for watching. Make sure you leave a like, comment, subscribe for more. See you all next time. Keep playing, keep laughing. Logan out.